This one is called Where Art I Willy. Our Willy is tattooed with some of Edinburgh's most iconic locations. Can you name them all? Edinburgh is full of many beautiful sights that we often take for granted. Take this opportunity to look up and look around you. So I was looking at some of these, I couldn't figure half of them out, I only, I only guessed about five. Um, I had to do the voiceover bit again because it was so windy you could hardly hear me. Like that, that's the, I think that's the clock at the end of Princess Street where Fraser's was, uh, the shop. It's, it's not fr Fraser's anymore, it changed to something else. Some sort of harbour, you know, I don't know if it's Leaf or what, that one. That, oops. That one on the foot. Right, I don't really know what that one, what place that one is. That one on that foot, I thought it was maybe like the one of the galleries at the foot of the mound. The one that's right at the bottom. Yeah, I'm not sure what that one is. It's nice, nice artwork though. That's the one o'clock gun. That's at Edinburgh Castle. Can you name all? There are time. Can you name all? I don't know if it was twenty-one or something. I don't know what that thing is. <laughs> I think the duck thing be below. I think I've seen them. They're just like you know, made it metal kind of thing. Yeah, I don't know what that bit is there. Um, I think that last one there was Calton Hill, up Calton Hill. Um, I don't know, I think that's maybe somewhere on the Royal Mile, I think, one of the streets there, I'm not sure. Oh, the head bit looks amazing, look at that. Brilliant detail. There's Greyfriars Bobby. They've made his nose different because everyone like goes to the statue and rubs its nose. I've never seen that one there. That looks crazy. I've seen that though. That's in uh, St Andrew's Square Garden. It's like a big wooden sort of um, lion. I'm not sure what that one is. If it's like John Knox's house or something, I, I don't know. I, can't. I think a few of these are probably on the Royal Mile, like on the High Street. It's really nice artwork here. Yeah. Yeah, it was really, it's quite open, so it was really, and it was really windy that day that um, I filmed it. I was thinking at the time it didn't look like Grey Fires Bobby, but it's because the nose is all worn away, it's like. But look at that, it's brilliant, that bit on the head. It's like a stained glass window. I would guess it's from St Giles Cathedral, maybe, I, 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 don't, I don't know. I don't know what these stones were meant to be either. These it's here. Name the location. I thought they could have made it easier. Yeah, that head bit was brilliant. Look at that. 
And that picture there on the back is really good as well. Yeah, I think that's on Cal Calton Hill, that bit. That one. So yeah, I think I don't know if I named like five or six. Yeah, and I think that's for the gallery at the foot of the mount. It's a nice one, it's nicely drawn. That's definitely one of Club Gun at the castle. Yeah, I don't know what the ones are. It's all like line art. I think I've seen maybe ducks. I think I might be at the top of the leaf. Like made it a metal. Some bloke on a horse. Apparently he was great. I looked like a phoenix or something. I can't remember. But that's def That was definitely the clock at the other end of Princess Street. Right? Not, not the, that one there on the left. That was my favourite bit there on the on the head. I think it's like stained glass window, but just with all the bumps in that on his head, it's just like. Kind of fits in with the design. So yeah, that was a uh, Fuerarte Willie.